Hey everyone, Dr. Jenny at Prochiropractic here this morning and today I just wanted to explain a little bit more about when people have headaches, when they have upper back pain. Um, Cassie in particular here has some of that going on and has had that going on for a couple of years. And I just want to explain what we do in the office for that particular issue and why it's important what we do. So Cassie, what's been going on with you? Um, I've suffered from chronic headaches for about two years now, so in severe like upper back neck pain. So, And so Cassie's been adjusted, which helps, but also we're going to look more at her structure underneath and why it's important to take x-rays and see that even though she's young, um, she doesn't have as much degeneration as someone who's older, but we want to look at her structure um, to reason why she has some chronic headaches and what's going on a little deeper. So I'm going to take you into the room, we're going to look at our x-rays quick, then we're going to come back in here and we're going to explain what we're going to do to try and help Cassie uh, to not just feel out of pain, but to have less headaches and, and to enjoy and start in, uh, feeling better overall. So. Alright, so we're back here in our x-ray studio and we're just going to briefly glance at Cassie's x-rays so again you guys have a better idea of what we're doing and what we're doing with Cassie. So with Cassie is we want to have her cervical curve, or is the back of these bones, is this red line. This is her curvature. Normal line, where those red bones should be at, or those red lines should be at, should be matched up with this green line. So Cassie has significantly lost a huge portion of her cervical curve. She's at one degree in there in her cervical curve, and it should be around 35 degrees. This causes, when we lose that curvature in there, also causes anterior head carriage. So she has about 36 millimeters of anterior head carriage in her middle spine, in her middle C-spine, and about 40 millimeters in her upper cervical. So this should be way back here. When this happens, this causes a lot of pressure on that spinal cord that runs right through here, and also can cause a lot of tension in the muscles and upper back. Um, so what we're gonna do with Cassie is we're gonna use something called a cervical general to help get this red line back to the screen right, line. So we're back here with Cassie and what we're going to use with Cassie now is called something called the cervical dental roll. So with this dental roll is this is what I have Cassie lay on passively to let her ligaments relax and get that curvature back in her neck. This is what I have Cassie do not only in the office on our cervical regainer chair which we will talk about or it's in some of our other videos but we also have her lay on the dental roll at home. If I um, give this to a patient, I recommend a patient lay on it five times a week, twice a day minimum. Okay, so that means that's a lot of home care that Cassie needs to do herself to get her curvature back where it needs to be. So what I have a patient do is go ahead and lean over there. We're going to flip her around here. Usually I have a patient lay on the floor, but for the purposes of this video, I'm going to have Cassie lay on the table. And what I'm going to do with this, I'm going to have this flat end towards her back, and then I'm going to have her relax nice and gently over that and letting her neck relax and get again that curvature where we want that green line on her x-ray to be equal with where her neck um, and that red line that was straight and forward here to now be relaxed over that. So that's what we would have patients do um, at home along with getting adjusted in the office to one help decrease headaches, um, decrease upper neck pain and stress and tension in the upper back um, for something that happens quite a bit with patients that are on computers a lot or on their cell phones a lot and iPads and, and cell phones. So if you are struggling with headaches, if you're struggling with upper back pain, chronic, this is something I'd highly recommend for you um, to do as well as get adjusted. Have a great, wait. Have a great day, Dr. Jenny at Pro Chiropractic.